everyone. Oh, it's Monday. It's stupid our 5 a.m. I want you to show them what you're about to do because this is a throwback. If you guys have been watching my vlog channel for years, comment below. Let me know. Sorry, I've got my Invisalign tray and that's what I'm probably talking about. Look what Hamish is back to drinking. I ain't doing it. The good green stuff. Oh, I can't even smell it. It smells so bad. It tastes like pineapple, right? No, it doesn't. It's not at all. Bad pineapple. I need to take these out because I'm talking weird. <gasps> what do you mean, wait? <laughs> Go. Ah, uh, it's really like these chunks in there. I think if you do it with warm water, it like, yeah, it's not great. Mm. Is it yum? Oh, it's too big chunks in there. Oh. You know when your throat stops you from. Yeah. That's yeah. right. Hi, darling. What? Oh, you landed on my toe. I did. Zeus. This nail. Zeus. 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 What? Yes. Oh, is that right? Is that right? Is that right? You're still licking my toes, you weirdo. Why are you so excited? Why are you so excited? Why are you so excited? He's such a happy boy. Look at him go. Guess he did. What is his tail? You know he's excited when his tail does like full like circles. Uh, one mouse. Yeah. Ding ding ding. What are you doing? Hi. You're so cute. Where's your brother? Is he asleep? Your brother will be asleep in the blankets, won't he? Being lazy. Hi. It was a good workout. We did like I think half an hour of cardio and we did some weight training, which is good because I haven't done weight training in ages. Gotta do some editing now. We're actually gonna shower first because I stink. So I'm just making some chicken, bacon, onion, pasta using this fettuccine. Low carb, what is it called again? The Slendia Cognac Noodles. Spinach as well, but also got a new toothbrush. Well, it's actually not new, so basically accidentally broke my old one. Long story, not really a long story, just accidentally broke it. Got a new one. They're from Vanity Planet, actually. I think this is the upgrade. So, one for the beach house as well. But yeah, it's my favorite toothbrush. I love it so much. And it actually does have a really long battery life. Me and Hamish take ours overseas and literally never have to charge it overseas. We just like pack it as is and it lasts. Creamy. I will never understand where all of the spinach goes. Like, where, where is it? <laughs> Good morning. I didn't vlog much last night because I didn't really do much. I didn't even eat dinner. I wasn't even hungry. We had lunch. What did we have for lunch? We had that chicken pasta thing. And then after that, I edited and we played Overwatch and that's all we did all night. Hopefully today's a little bit more exciting. So me and Amish are about to go to the gym. It's early again, like I think just before seven. Just put all of my packages to one side, go back from the gym. Hamish and I just did um, cardio and what did we do? Shoulders and back. Yeah. So Hamish is off to work. Oh, shoulders and chest, not shoulders and back. Anyway, so I'm going to show now wash my hair and I'm going to film today. I'm also going to upload my, what's it called? Worst makeup, full face of the worst makeup or full face of makeup I hate. Oh, that took so long. I need to get into filming because shortly it's going to be too late. I wanted to do a first impression of a foundation and I really like to wear them as long as I can. So I need to go do that now. Look at this boy. Are you under the blankets or on top of the blankets? I can't tell, Bugs. I can't tell. You look so comfy, though. I'm a bit jealous. Just a little bit. Oh, <gasps> I didn't even see you there because you just blended in so cute with that freaking rug. Look at you. Oh, he's so sweet. Zeus has just been the cutest dog for the last, like, you know, ever since we got back. I think he missed us. He's just been so cute. So yeah, I've got a couple of trips coming up and I'm taking some of my friends instead of Hamish. Hamish is going to stay home because he's done a lot of travel with me this year and he's just kind of like, I just, you know, I'm, I think I'm done for now. And I just can't wait to spend some nice time overseas with my friends and take them for the little brand experiences and stuff. It's going to be so much fun. Um, and also it means that Hamish can be home with the dogs. Although the dogs always stay with my best friend when we go away. She house sits for us and the dogs love her too. But, you know, I think they just miss their mums and James, don't you? Yes. So he's been such a sweetheart lately. He's just been, like, so clingy and following me around the house and just being so cute. Look at him. 
I'm getting a haircut this weekend. Are you excited? You'll be able to see again. So I just filmed the first part of a foundation first impression. How do you guys think it looks? Let me get in the nicer lighting. I think it looks pretty friggin dope. Like flawless, a little bit glowy. Um, I'm going to make a quick iced coffee and then I'm going to film a little look using my EXO Beauty palette that we're bringing out soon in the next couple months hopefully just because i'm trying to get some content for when we launch to show you guys some different looks you can create um i'll still do like youtube videos too like i'm just filming some like igtvs but i'll obviously do youtube tutorials using it too just because i'm going to film a unboxing next so it's the perfect time just to play with my palette create an igtv um and i'll put out that igtv closer to the time of launch so you guys can see it then but you'll see the look obviously later in the vlog now Iced coffee time. Let's go. I don't know where my tripod is, so. That is so good. I look like a crazy lady with this like perfect skin and nothing else on. Imagine, you know, having skin this perfect in real life. Like some people have skin like this in real life and to be honest, I hate them. No, I'm joking. I don't hate them, but I'm severely jealous. <laughs> Time to blow dry this mop of hair. I applied some of this earlier uh, on my chest and everything because the foundation looked like it was going to be a little bit too dark. And this takes a while to develop, I'm pretty sure, because... It didn't really make me darker yet. Yeah. I'm like, oh, my camera's gonna die. Yes, I'm lazy with all of this stuff because, um, since I go away again soon, I'm probably just gonna keep it all packed up and just, you know, free pack it into my suitcase when I have to go away next. <laughs> I've got some pink staining in my hair, don't mind that. I swear my hair's just been amazing since collagen as well. Like, just doesn't break and snap as much. Like, I had this really short layer, like, not that long ago. And where's the shortest part of my hair now? Like, it's there, probably. Like, and it used to be, like, up there. It's just grown so long. And shiny. Oh, I love this too. I change up my hair care products all the bloody time. But, um... I've been using this Gold Wild Rich Repair Sex Effect Serum. It smells so good. You guys don't understand. So I just put that in before I brush my hair as well. Sometimes I do it before I blow dry, but I forgot. So I did it after today. Okay, I better go charge this friggin' camera. Otherwise, you're not gonna get any vlog footage later. What were you two doing in my filming room? Cheeky monkeys. Hmm? That's so nosy. This little bum. Hey, give a kiss. Thank you. Hamish came home with a cheeky wine. We haven't had <laughs> red in a while, eh? Yeah. Johnny, cute. 2015 trays. I haven't tried it yet. I'm just eating a sausage. <laughs> and a sausage and what? <laughs> and olives. olives. Oh, they're so yum. These ones are the best, but they don't come with a lid. I had the most amazing productive day. The sound in the back and the copyright. That's right. I filmed an IGTV on my eye makeup. The first impression. I'm still filming that and um a unboxing massive unboxing so that'll be up soon i like sat there i did some research on youtube to find some new video ideas and i've like got some really cool like content i want to film so i'm going to do that this week sounds good tomorrow night we've got dinner with my family where? yeah i don't know where yeah, i think don't. nana's house i reckon we'll just take like either chicken and stuff or we could get like burger fuel or something I'll just take anyway yeah. um and do you like it i'm ready Try it. I reckon it's real nice. Take a decent mouthful. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Mm hmm It's real good, right? Yeah. Smooth Where's ass. Where's that from? Countdown. Yeah, Johnny Q. That's Shirai. probably a favorite. That's very, yeah. like, 
it's almost a little bit sweet and like watery. But not sweet as in sugary sweet, nah, just not, not like. Sweet. No, but it's not like vinegary or anything. It's I feel like, like it's very basic. Like it's very just like goes down. I've got sausage without, stuck in my teeth. It's, it's not very vinegary. <laughs> so it's just like I just want the sausage. Mate, there's an olive in here for you. No. You can't have it. He's had too many treats this week because we got home from our trip and of course we were like, here, eat carrot and an egg and have a mouthful of our Thai food and some bacon. And now I'm like, nah, you're on no treat ban for the week. Got it, mate. Mmm, I should be on a no treat band too, but... That's not really... Is that a tray? Is it all of a tray? Good. How much is this? I is think it's it on a... special though, it's $18. Okay, so it's like an expensive supermarket wine. But it's good. Well, a bottle of wine, cool, mm. you get tipped out for that. Well, yeah, we have to remember this for if we have to get Bevan and Michaela a gift. Yeah. I feel like they'd like it. <laughs> so yeah, I've just been... On the computer doing some research and a little bit of editing. As soon as Hamish, he came home after a meeting today. So he was home like 20 minutes earlier than normal. And the dog's like, oh yeah, it's dinner time. But it's not. Unfortunately for you guys. They've started waking us up at like 5am every morning like, feed us. Assholes. I'm not about that life. Did he have his dinner? Yeah. And he's Why still, is he? He is still here. Look, Why are you acting like you have not uh, had dinner? Huh? When he doesn't get enough attention from you, he'll come to me. I know. You're such a naughty little slug. Just, Look at yeah. you. You don't care. You're just hungry. <laughs> He's always hungry. I'm always hungry. Always hungry. Always up a trick. Look at oh, those. No, no. Don't tease him. So for dinner tonight, Hamish is cooking me some lamb. We've got some broccoli. And what else are we having? Coleslaw. Yes, yeah. Oh, you've already made us about to make it. Coleslaw. Yeah. I was just filming my little update for my yeah, full face first impression. I have to say though guys, that wine, which is now vanished, I think it's my new favorite wine, or slash, I think it might be the best red wine I think I've ever had. I'm not even joking, it's so good. Who do you think you are? You're even being nice on camera. Usually you run away when I whip out the camera. Where's your toy? Where's your toy? Where's your toy? Where's, where's this, have you shown them their favorite? This little, little bone. bone. I don't even know, Louis took it last I saw. Where's the bone? You've probably taken it outside to just get destroyed. It must be here No, here it is. It's, it's in Louie's bed. So this is Zeus's favorite toy at the moment. So this tiny little thing. He <laughs> just ran past. Zeus, what's this? He thinks he's getting food. Nah. What's this? Nah, hey, Zeus, he's not interested because he just wants food. Yeah, da, da. You want it now because, oh, classic. Attention seeker. Louis like, yeah, it's mine. You do this, she comes to the kitchen and you try and cook over what I'm cooking. I wanted to say, do you want to give a little update on what we're working on at Exo Beauty without naming any names or anything? Secret. Hamish has been talking to a local design company and we're doing up little like gondola, like what do you call them? Makeup displays. So like when you go into like a department store and all of the makeup is on a acrylic display with like the TV screens and the little stands for all the makeup and all the testers, that's what Hamish has been looking at at the moment. So we'll keep you guys updated. Well, we got into, looks really good. We got into some wholesale stores and we're like, we don't really... We don't have a proper stand. We don't have a proper stand yet. So yeah. this is like kind of what we're working on. We've got some stands and then we've got some more exciting news soon, hopefully. Yeah, we'll keep you guys updated and we've got a couple so. of maybe meetups and stuff planned. Oh, we've got some definite. Like, you know how we did an, yeah, we did an EXO Beauty meetup in Auckland recently, so you guys came. So we're probably going to do another couple. I'm not going to give you any information until it's like locked in, because I don't want to like give anyone false hopes and stuff, but keep yep. an eye out because, yeah. Should be good. Sizzle, listen to that sizzle. This is the best. This is a Kmart steamer, and it's just as good as our George Foreman one, oh, our old... Better. No, our old George Foreman one. So our old George Foreman was amazing. Well, it was amazing. Then we got the new George Foreman one because our old one broke. We had it for what, like six years? Yeah. So fair enough. So it broke. We bought the new George Foreman one. They didn't sell the same one as us anymore, the one that we had. And it was Leaking. so it bad. It leaked. We got a replacement. The replacement leaked. So we just asked for a refund. And Hamish went to Kmart and got this one. 
Like way cheaper, eh? Like how much was yeah, it? Yeah, no, it was way cheaper, and it's it's good too because it's it a used simple to have, one. This has a timer, mm. and the last one had like just buttons. A random, no, it just had dials. Yeah, oh, but it also so it had like yeah, two it buttons, and it was like press that button and then tap that button, yeah, no. and then it would beep, and I'm like, what does that mean? Yeah. Whereas this one is so simple, it's just rotate, done. You got your water level. You we steam everything. Look at that. Steam everything. Look at this. Vegetable wise. We, have, we don't do like the steamed fish and steamed meat. We just do steamed veggies. You, you could probably cook steam. No, you can. You can steam like salmon. And, I prefer like fried salmon though. Like I'm not going to steam my fish. Did you so, tell yeah. them that uh, we're going to Tomorrowland next year? Probably. No, we are. Hold on. We're going to try and get tickets. We've been chatting to Carly. We all want to do another festival. Our friend John, you know John. We're roping him in. He basically got okay. forced into it. I know he is now. He got forced Easy. into it. We're like, John, you'll come. And he's like, what? What? And we're like, you'll come to Europe. And he's like, yeah. I guess. So, 100%. Yeah. Be good. So, we've got some things to look forward to next year. Also, another update. I feel like we're just doing a lot of updates right now because we've been traveling and like life's been hectic. But mm. the beach house. Oh, it's looking good. Oh, it's I got some photos. Good. I'll. I don't know if I'll show you yet or if I'll show you once the weatherboards are on, but basically all the plastering. No, they're on. on. They're on. The weatherboard just needs to be painted. Yeah. You never know that. Yeah. So yeah, the weatherboards just have to be painted. So you know how we were asking you guys like 80 times what colours to do. The colours look good yeah. so far. So we did the um, lighter silver colour on the plaster and it looks really good. And yeah, yeah so I'll show you how it looks at the end because you guys did help us like finalise all that. It's pretty exciting. That's supposed to be done in like what, like one month? No, about 20 something days. It's <laughs> almost like we've been, this has been a long ass haul. It's been such a journey. And it hasn't been cheap and it's been stressful. It's so. been very stressful for Hamish, especially. Oh. He's the one like making all the big calls. So yeah, it's been a crazy experience and it's kind of shit because we wish we could have vlogged more of it, but we aren't in the same city. So nah, kind of you'll get to see when we when we do when we go house, up next, you'll we'll see that. Up. Yeah, you'll see that. Mm -hmm. but yeah, when one. we when we build in Palmerston North, we're gonna do way more vlogs about it all. Like it'll yeah. be like a whole like I think we'll do like a whole series, we'll um, start everywhere. to finish. Yeah, yeah, we'll do like a weekly video like when you do um, something new happens all right there. Yeah, so we'll like show you like the building process. We'll show you, you know, actually ground up. We'll show you all of the decoration. We'll show you what like fittings we choose like everything but um for the beach house obviously we're not right there so i've been showing you what i can but it's a bit difficult but um I showed some last time didn't i yeah you did no that was amazing i'll show you when if you guys search on my channel beach house update you yeah. can see the vlog hamish filmed once once it's done i'll show you some of the changes i did and mm -hmm. i'll show you why i did the changes yeah so i think you'll like really really like to see the difference between like when it was first done to how it is now. Yeah, and if you guys search on my vlog channel, I did do a beach house tour. Yeah. So you can see kind of like what it would look like. And when we go back up next time, we'll obviously show you guys what we changed. Oh, by the way, when we yeah. go to Tomorrowland, we're doing like, we're going to arrive two days early, go to Tomorrowland. And then after that, we're going to go to Amsterdam. Maybe. No, we are. For okay. the third time. Why not? One more time. Absolutely. If you're with good people, I think anywhere is good. We wouldn't go back by ourselves, yeah. but you know, if other people want to, we'll go. This should be almost finished now. It is done. Alright, this will be done. Yeah, this done. That's done. I put it on a little bit longer. Oh, love that sound. This is what we went with tonight. If you guys want to comment down below and mm -hmm. let us know if you were to buy a beach house, where are your favourite locations and why? I think that the best location is where you got one. Papamoa, yeah. the Mount, or Wangamata. Mm -hmm. Is that how you say it? Fong, 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 I'll butcher that. Well, some people aren't from New Zealand. Where is like... Well, people in New Zealand, no, 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 I'm no, no, sorry. No, no, no. Well, people internationally won't. No. Okay, so wherever you live, where is your favourite beach? That's basically the question here. If you could buy a house at any where beach, would be? where would it be? Where would it be? If I was to get one internationally, I would go straight to the Gold Coast. That's Australia. What about in America? In America? I don't even, I've only been to like LA, Indianapolis and New York. I yeah, don't know. I, don't know. I really liked New York. 
Did great. you like New York? Yeah, it was cool. It was so much fun. People were like, please do a meet up. I would love to one day. But our trip was so short. It was like, we were there, we slept. We were at e Izu. I was going to say EDC. That's what we said. The and whole then we time. were like with Carly and we went home. Like, I would love to come back to New York and do Sometimes. some more stuff and do a meet up one day. But sometimes it's nice to like sometimes you well. just go and you unwind unfortunately like we wish we could vlog everything but yeah it's that's nice why we didn't vlog about but i forgot to mention that like it was just such a nice time just to unwind like me and him should have been so busy with mm. work like both of us on our own jobs and so it was really nice just to go away and like relax a little bit we still vlogged you know oh this was what i was gonna say what? cool so if you guys want to know <laughs> yes. what's been good lately um, how good has waking up and been going to the gym early? Yeah, this is, this I can't remember if I talked it. about it in the vlog, but I think I may have mentioned it this mm. morning, but we've been utilizing a bit of a bedtime. So for a while, it. like we were just like, whenever we were tired, sometimes we sleep at 10, sometimes it was 1am, like, and that Tw was not good. One. Sometimes. Tw really? I mean, for me, um, you know, more likely like midnight. So we've both decided that we need to start going to bed a little bit earlier and wake up earlier to go to the gym. You guys know I used to just go midday, do some work in the morning, then stop, go to the gym, stop, come back you to were work. talking about it today and how much. It's make, it. yeah, it's just, you know, like I used to do this years ago. Me and Hamish both would get up at like 7 and go to the gym. I think the perfect home. time is it's like just, get up at 6.30, yeah. leave at 7, yeah, I know. go for an hour. We'll get there. Um, oh, well, we went 7. We went but no, it makes the biggest difference just... I don't know. You're not so you rushed throughout the day. You're not going out halfway through the day. Yeah. Even though I don't like take a lunch break. So like for me going to the gym was my lunch break. It's still just like a lot to do. Like <laughs> instead of relaxing or anything like you're at the gym. So it's good just to like get it all over and done with first thing in the morning. And it's nice going to the gym with Hamish because for ages we've just been going like alone. So it's nice to go together I think as well and yeah. hang out. I, I think it's better going before work. So after work you chill. Everyone's like, oh, yep. I don't know. I'm like, no. Go before, mm -hmm. after work, relax. And it gives you more energy throughout the day, I feel. When I go yeah, to the gym in the morning, up. I've got more energy. And once you're up, you're up, right? Yeah. Like, when the alarm goes off. I've just been so tired, yeah. like, before this. I don't know, it's almost like this jet lag's given me a little blessing, like, <laughs> yeah, because is. I'm jet lagged, I'm, like, waking up early by default it's because of yeah. the New York time difference and everything. And so, like, I'm just taking advantage of it and not, like, forcing myself to sleep in when I'm fine if I wake up at, like, Seven. Okay, we're gonna like eat and go play some Overwatch probs. So I'll check you in a bit. I have to show you guys what the fuck I live with. Hamish puts this back in the fridge. That's from a wheel of brie. Excuse me. Hamish! <laughs> Don't laugh! You're useless! What is that? That look at that. That is terrible. Absolutely appalling. I'm gonna take this out of the fridge and not replace it. And Hamish gonna get angry at me because I always do that. <laughs> Makes me want to cry. There is a giveaway right there for you guys, though. So that's nice. This isn't even all of it. I already got rid of half of it. The first impression it was the Fenty Hydrating Foundation, um, the Luminous, whatever it's called. Definitely pros and cons. So I'm gonna have a shower now and wipe it all off. You guys will see the tutorial or the review soon. Look at this cute boy. Are you sitting on my spot? Hmm? Are you sitting on my spot at the bed? Yes, you are. Look at that tail. Look at that tail. It's out of control. All right, guys. I just had a shower and now I am going to go to sleep. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and I'll talk to you guys again tomorrow. Bye.